One of the half-term activities we have going on here is a lantern parade. And I've been working on this design for a magic lantern for some time. Largely so I had something to do with the kids. We're using a micro bit which allowed us to learn a bit of micro python. And a monks make RGB LED board which allows us to shine a light. The rest of the construction is based around these empty milk jugs which, combined with some 3D printed parts and some zip ties, is all the structure that's needed. The micro bit is designed to be connected to peripheral boards via alligator clips, which makes it very accessible. I've actually got a previous video on this little 3D printed block, which allows uh, bolts to be used instead of alligator clips. The 3D printed box is hot glued to the top of the lantern, which allows the battery pack to be zip tied on the outside, which leaves the on off switch accessible and keeps it out of the way of the light. I 3D printed these thin decals that can be stuck on the outside. They cast quite a nice woodland magical shadow. I've not quite figured out whether this is going to be a handheld lantern or on a stick, a so-called bindle lantern. Uh, for now I've just used this loop of wire as a temporary handle while I figure that out. Working with the kids, I've been really impressed by the microbit and the micropython libraries. They make the functionality of the microbit really accessible. The lantern flickers this sort of eerie blue and if the accelerometer detects a, a quick change, it picks a random colour and changes through that, which is what makes it a magic lantern. This is actually magic lantern number two, the first I've actually made in the week with the kids, but we didn't film any of that process. Thank you for watching, stay safe and enjoy the holidays.